I'm going to do away with something that I promise you is going to show up on our station and across media here over the next few months. The panic meter. I don't have one. It's gone. I know you don't. They've won four rings, and there are reasons for them being where they are right now. Some of them are better than others. I don't have a panic meter, okay? There is no panic. They're the Warriors. I trust them. They're going to make good decisions. And if there's any way for them to be involved in April, May, and June, I have full confidence that they will be. But April, May, and June? And June. Do you want to make the guru bet? Because I, I was trying to get a piece of that yesterday. Guru and Steiny made a bet. Guru I, bet Steiny 100 bucks that the Warriors would win the championship. Steiny, took, Steiny the took the field. Uh, I wanted to get in yesterday well, on a off. piece of that action. But, uh, so you're asking me if I'll do the same bet with you? You be Guru, I'll be Steiny. I want you to listen to me very, very closely. No, I listened yesterday when you talk blocked me when I was trying to get a piece I, of that action. I want you to listen to me very, you said, very closely. Guru, don't do it, Guru, no! Here's my answer. Yeah, I'll say that word again. Thank you, Spadone. The answer is... No. No, no, I'm not making that bet with you. You just it's said good. April, May, and June. Yes. If there's a way for them to be involved, I have full confidence. In April, May, and June. Right. Gary, tell me the odds. June. Involved. Involved. If they're involved in the NBA Finals, will well, you then make the bet? First of all, the conference finals wiggle their way into June. I got to check that and out. Second, I got to confirm second that. Second of all, being, you in, wiggle being me. involved in June does not mean winning. Okay. <laughs> No. By the way, if the- they're in the NBA Finals, would you then make that bet? If it's them versus fill in the blank Eastern Conference no, opponent, you're gonna ask me then. I don't know. No, of course you no, would. No, then I, no, I'm not making stupid bets with you That's, today. No, no, I'm not. I'm not saying <laughs> to make the bet now. But if we get to June and it's the Warriors versus yeah, probably Scott, da, 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 Milwaukee da, da, or Boston or whomever, or Brooklyn, whatever. You're, then at that point, you're making that bet. Probably, yeah, because things have gone incredibly right since then. Or since now, right? For them to get to that point, that's kind of like the Brock Purdy question. Wow, if Jimmy Garoppolo's healthy, then then what? If the 49ers have won ten in a row and Brock Purdy wins the next two weekends, I'm sorry. You want to bench him for who? You want to bench him for what? I'm not benching him for anyone, let alone Jimmy Garoppolo. So no, they, they, like if you get to then, then obviously things have gone very differently than they're going now. But the larger issue is the entire sport of basketball, college and pro, right now seems to be sending us the same message. The good teams are sending the same message. We'll see you after football. We'll see you when football's over. Are the Warriors a good team? Yes. I don't even know. I I mean, I don't know anymore. But they're like a good team in waiting. They're like, we'll be good when we need to be good. I remember this. Ready? Get the drop ready. Spadone, get the drippy drop ready. So when I was covering the Lakers, and I used to talk to Kobe and Shaq after every game. Oh, my God. Kobe? Shaq was the one who coined this. Do you do a Shaq? Everybody does a Shaq. I don't do impressions (laughs) that everybody does. I don't do Ronald Reagan. I don't do Arnold Schwarzenegger. I do a one-word Reagan. And I don't do Shaq. Well... yeah, it's, and it's pretty good. Well, yeah. So keep it to one. Oh, that then it got creepy. Well, okay, so that, anyway. That's what he used to call Nancy. <laughs> well, <laughs> mommy. It's so weird. Nancy. So anyway. Well. Shaq, Shaq was the one who really got the flip the switch thing going. And and he even would say, like. Tell me how he'd say it. He was terrible at shooting free throws. I'm terrible at shooting free throws. <laughs> he, I'll make them when they matter. And that's you a, do do it, yeah, Shaq. Uh, th- that's what he would say. But you know what? Like, if that that has now taken over the whole damn league, look. We'll flip the switch when we need to. We'll be there when it matters. We'll, we'll be there when it matters. I don't know. As a fan, sometimes I want to go, me too. Let me know when it matters, and I'll show up. Because I wasted 45 minutes of my 8 year old sleep last night. Poor guy. You know what I mean? He's going to have to gut that out. And by the way, you're April, May, and June. I hate to be a uh, captain mm. corrector here, but uh, the Western and Eastern Conference Finals concluded before May itself had concluded. Last year. Correct. Well, it's so the schedule this year. Well, the, the schedule, <laughs> it all depends on a, you know, whether or not it goes seven so games. Maybe it's going to go to June 1st. April, May, and June. June is the NBA Finals. Yes. The, the finals last year started on June 2nd. So, and I'll have to see, because the dates are already slotted in this year. Well, let's take a look. The NBA Finals. I'll tell you right now. Yeah, no, I, I, bet I, I bet I can beat you to it. It's your turn to talk. Yeah. Oh, look at me <laughs> actually getting a turn. 
What a novel turn. Yeah. June 1st, the NBA Finals begin. Uh, yeah, but there, so could again, be, but there could be delays. You never know. Oh, so, you call for anyway. another pandemic? Yeah. <laughs> Let's score no, this one for Dibber Claws.